Um, I play Rain Sinclair and she, um, her mutant power, um, her name is Wolfsbane and she has the ability to shapeshift into like a um, werewolf and then she can also go full wolf. And so I guess her power is to have like super heightened senses and she can see really well in the dark and hear things that are super far away and smell everything. <laughs> <laughs> Um, hi, uh, I play Danny Moonstar, and my power is to make people's deepest fears uh, come to life. Um, and it can like really physically hurt you, it can kill you. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a Mirage, which is my superhero name, Mirage. Yeah. Uh, I play Dr. Cecilia Reyes. Uh, she's the person taking care of this medical facility that has these young mutants, these new mutants. And she is a mutant herself. She can put force fields around her and uh, around people. And she's someone that uh, has a plan for these kids and, and is just trying to, to guide them through understanding their powers. All right, next question. Um... How did you approach these characters, each of whom has suffered some pretty hardcore stuff? I imagine there is a fine line between playing your roles as someone the audience feels for and can relate to without making them whiny and annoying. Ooh, interesting question, <laughs> girls. <laughs> um, yeah, I think for the biggest thing that stood out to me was with Rain is how much she doesn't say. And so there's a lot with her that is internalized. And so that can be quite a difficult thing to do when you are in a room full of actors and all of you are playing these characters and you're trying to, you know, be a prominent player and you have nothing to say. And, and so I think that, that that gives you a lot of space to just internalize a lot. And um, as an actor, I think I definitely learned a lot about myself in trying to discover the person within me who doesn't speak at any given moment and who um, does keep a lot of things like within her own head. And um, I think a lot of people are gonna really relate to that. Me, not so much because I can't stop talking. <laughs> <laughs> but you're watching this film well. <laughs> um, you know, playing Danny is hard because she has um, she has to talk about what happened to her a lot, even from right from the beginning, because she's just gotten there. Um, I think I feel like we did actually while filming like some reworks on some of the dialogue because we found that she would end up she would just be talking about like oh, well, you don't understand, you know, what happened. And um, we were kind of like, well, this is gonna be actually a little repetitive. And I don't think she needs to, um, you don't need to talk about it that much. Like what Maisie's saying, it's like what you don't say. Um, yeah. But it's definitely, it's hard to play a character that's been hurt so much. But um, Danny's like a little, she's like soft-spoken, but she's tough. So she's like, a, I think she's like an in-between of Anya and Maisie's character where she's like kind of like, a little moody and aggressive, but she's also very shy and soft-spoken and like a little numbed out um, by all the pain that she's feeling. So I tried to go that direction instead of going into whiny. <laughs> um, but you know, yeah. <laughs> I think it's really cool that you see that you, all of you guys, I mean, you guys achieved something that was, was interesting that it normally, these characters are always portrayed in normal films, meaning not action or hero films, superhero films. They would be the problematic teen or the, the teen that has issues or the teen that is a pro, like, there's always something related to that. And in this film, in a way, which I think the X-Men always do, is that what is called the different and what is the one that is not the normal, they are the heroes and their struggle is what makes this stronger. And I think you guys really understood that with Josh, with the work that you guys did was really nice to see is that through the work and through the preparation, understanding these this, this traumas, being character driven, it's what made the, the film different. Meaning you guys from the pain becoming powerful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 